I have no idea where I'm supposed to go now. Oh, I see. I have multiple places of entry here. I see, I need to get that box up there, don't I? Uh, somehow that box needs to get up there. I, I, it's not gonna get... There, that should give me just enough reach. Shit, that took too long. I have no clue what the perfect angle for this one is. Hmm. I don't know how I did that. Okay, so what next? Killed. There. Oh, these are getting worse. There we go. Ooh, no, that's gonna be a tough one to jump to make. Or not. Laser pickaxe, okay. Moving on, don't care about these rocks. Save, because this might be an enemy room. Attack me, jerks. I got the power of fire on my side now. Damn, my range attack kind of sucks. There we go. Cool. Thief's key. Now I can open these chests as needed. But that'll be a lower priority than finishing the actual fucking dungeon. Oh yeah. Let's 
see. Even just doing nothing will cool down my element thing a bit. How do I go about this? I want to have them spaced apart enough so I can still get there, huh? like that. Mm. I want this, that one there to be last, if possible. Oh shoot. Bad move. to go down here eventually so I can make it across there, but... Hmm. These jumps look outright impossible right now. Not good. There we go. I wasted so much time in that fucking room. Equipment. It's almost been an hour. Nope, I'm running out of time. This dungeon is too fucking huge. Oh no, it's a puzzle. Oh shit. What does this do? I see, I need to get all one of these into here to serve as a platform, huh? Two of them in there, actually.
stuck now. I need one more to get down there. Got it. The hell is this thing? It looks like I'm shooting fish in a barrel. Okay, just do that, and now I have to somehow get this thing over there. These are said and done. Okay. It's tricky. It worked. Oh no, another puzzle. Where do I want to go from here? Hmm, something's up with that bomb, huh? So will that help me somehow? Oh, I can't jump here for some reason. Oh, it just chucks me back here. Weird. Huh. Another one in these places. That one requires a key. No way, we've been here before. What the hell? We're in, back in B1? Oh, I see. Equipment detected one. Hmm. Oh no, it's a trap room. The hell? What's that all about? Don't tell me it's gonna attack me the moment I leave this part. Oh, burn, baby! Ow! I knew you were gonna trick me, fuckers. God damn it, I'm gonna run out of time. Emily's gonna take this round, that's for sure. What's the point of that? Oh, it gets me the B4. Wow, that's a lot of sh They respawn. Well, that could be an issue. Can they, can they, can they respawn if I step on them? No. It, that, that's not how I was hoping it would work. Okay. What the hell is with this room? Okay, so yeah, that could be complicated. There we go. That will be unlocked in case I ever need it. But this part's gonna be tough.
There. Mm. Another crazy fucking run. Gotcha! Fuck. Fucking shit, man. Ow. Crap, that could be bad. No, enemy room. It's not activated yet. Damn. Tell us it's gonna hurt. Okay, I see. I have to uncover every single enemy in this room by blowing up all the rocks. There. <sighs> Fuck. How am I even supposed to get up there anyways? Is there even a bomb that's high enough for this place? So that will get me there. Another one. Come. These puzzles are getting worse. No. Another soul stolen. Whoa. Laser TNT. Okay, now I need to get onto the higher ground. There, that might help. Ah, shit. That was kind of stimulating, but I got it. Now I just need to blow up these two rocks somehow. There, we got it. Was that optional or not? Ancient sandals. Damn it. Hmm. 
Hmm. A little bit of resistance for everything, huh? Oh no. Here, so I can get over there. Yeah, this, this puzzle's gonna suck. Oh, there we go. Let me redo that for better time. Finally, the mine key. Fuck, that was tough. Okay, so fruit here. I'm just bummed out. Oh man, I should just... Oh no, shooting puzzle. Actually, let's try this room first. This is labeled 37. Damn it. Um, these regenerating ice things are just on getting my nerves. Get off. Huh? Damn platformers. Let's see, now I can create. Ow. Okay, that takes care of that. Oh, that, that works too. Ow. Mine key. Yeah. I'm gonna redo that room. Okay, let's go south next. Oh, crap. There we go. Oh, come on, we have to do it again? Oh, I got it this time, fuck yeah. Mine key. That makes three of them. Or four of them. Yeah. Forgot to explore this one last time. I think this one might be able to help me deal with this bomb. Yes. There we go. Now I have a clear path. Let's hurry the fuck up, because... Uh, this dungeon... They really need to give me us a little more time for error for the Emily race. Seriously. Okay, now the path is clear. Oh, come on, don't tell me you already finished. Bugs everywhere! Oh, in all the rooms! Reload rocks inside eggs, yeah, yeah, I don't know. This is just the worst. Arg! Please give up and make my life easier. Oh, god, no, oh, no! The locks are all hidden behind the puzzle, too. Oh, and there's a... Yeah. Okay, grab that one. Okay, first off, I can get rid of this one real quick. But what does it do? 
I see, it just unlocks that path, but I need, still need to get all the others, too. Actually, can I snipe some of them from here? Yeah, so if I snipe them ahead of time, that makes my life easier. That makes zero keys, so now all I need to do is figure out a combination, winning combination. Okay. So... Move the down block south... West... Yeah, I'm just, fuck it, I'm just using a guide. No shame in using a guide when there's a fucking time limit. Hmm. Control block east. South. West. There we go. That should do it. Hmm. What? I see. There we go. <laughs> Fucking dungeon, okay. Who we gotta fight now? Oh shit, that's a lot of um. more Shit I overloaded Okay, got them all. Cool. Give me the ch key. The key blade. Anything interesting here? Okay, so get that open. Okay, there's gonna be a boss in here. Okay. Yeah, this is hope this doesn't take me the whole time limit. I have until 54. Oh boy. Do your thing.
pie sandwich just in case. Emergency sandwich just in, to be safe. There we go. That was a better victory than my first victory. Ha <laughs> ha. I mean, it wasn't great, but still. All right. Let's see if we beat Emily. Don't fall off. That would just lead to wasted time. In and in. I don't see Emily. That's a good sign. And there are other players, which means this is not an instance area. Yeah. Oh, you're first. You got me this time. I blame those bugs. We. Seriously, what was up with that battle for the Master Key? It's like they designed this dungeon after my worst nightmares. Oh well, I'll get you next time. Hmm, this room is strange, Non. Next time, I'm using a guide to ensure that I beat you no matter what. A guide for every single room, not just the really tough ones. And expect to see other players within the dungeon. I guess rooms like these are simply not instanced. Anyway, I think we should check out the statue up here, there. Actually, I think the guide only covers the first dungeon. The one in Neo Seeker. That sucks. So yeah, I'm gonna have to use my brain next time, which is bad. I don't have much of a brain. These mountains stood for eons nearly unchanged. Their frozen crown shimmering in the sun. Among these heights and hurdles you pre persevered. Wielding the blazing flames, you cleave through ice and stone alike. You, the traveler, the envoy of change. You have proven yourself worthy. Take this shade and continue on your journey. That means I can unlock more of my uh, uh, of my grid, my circuit. Let your every step from form the path of your growth. Congratulations, Seeker. You reached the first milestone of Operation Trackwalker. With the blue ice shade, you can access Maroon Valley to the west of Bergen. There awaits your next destination, the Fajro Temple, housing the second element, Cold. To proceed, seek an audience with the elders of the local village, Baki Kum. Take this reward for your accomplishments. The circuit override allows you to reset one of your circuit boards. Visit the first basement floor at the info hub in Rookie Harbor to use it. That is all. Good luck and stay vigilant. Bird people, bird people in space. So that's the ancients. Fair enough. Oh, Aloris, do you see those rotating info thingies? I bet those have all the info about the ancients we need. Don't forget about the quiz. Save. Does that mean Emily has her own fire form too? Probably. 
I don't see how else she could have beaten the boss. Yeah, circuits, I got... I guess I gained one c CP for... Uh, yeah, every, every grid has its own CP, huh? Yeah. Maybe I should go for... Let's focus on the defensive ones, huh? Considering how badly I've been getting my ass kicked. Also, are all... Of, no, some of these are actually 2 CP. Okay, good. Oh, yeah. Those are some de those are some pretty na gnarly battles, huh? Wonder if I should have used flame jab for the boss. Was actually let's test it out. Hmm, it seems like that would have been better for the boss. Concentrated damage rather than just the just the generic spin attack that's good for multiple enemies. Yes. That would have gotten me slightly more DPS. But yeah, for this, for normal enemies, Flame World should be good enough. Shooter. Hmm. Yeah, so long the elemental overload is really good here. But I don't think uh, there's going to be that many more of them. And they only apply to this form, of course. I missed a pick a laser pickaxe somewhere around here. Life on Shadunas prosper and Duorbis felt that Arkhine was ready to start a journey. The Aro, however, did not agree. He still saw Arkhine's infants crawling over the majestic surface he created. The Orbis then pointed to Shadun and asked the Aro to watch. The Aro saw how Arkhine climbed to the highest mountains and reached the very bottom of the sea. The Aro was shocked yet proud of our achievements. Reluctantly, he agreed that indeed we had been ready to start our journey. The Aro then prepared an envelope of solid rocks and ice used to send the message of the sky. And now is the goddess of shape, the mistress of the flame, and creator of the sun. Yet she was envious of her fellow gods who created fascinating shapes and worlds full of life and color. She longed to take part, adding a warming fire to these worlds, yet her flame was all too, was too mighty and consumed all in its path. It was then when Diaro had a proposal. He shaped a sphere with an empty core and several holes surrounded by high mountains. And all done filled this shape with her flame, creating a world with a heated core and life on its surface. Today, every volcano is a record of Enel and Diaro working in union. Diaro is the creator of solid surface. His powers could form most majestic mountains and freeze the vastest of seas. Indeed, his creations are enduring and overwhelming sights to behold, yet motionless and without life. They all started when Diorbis, the ethereal god of creation, was born into the emptiness of the void. After pondering for eons in solitude, his desire for company gave birth to the gods of shape. The arrow is one of these gods, the god of square and the creator of solid surface. Alright, just re read everything there is. We should head back to First Scholars HQ and take that quiz. Before that, I want to find that last pickaxe. Hopefully the puzzles do not reset annoyingly. Alright, second boss defeated. What do you think? Oh, they're going to discuss strategies. Huge pretty slow though, I, but I love the bomb punching. You know you can throw balls at the bombs, right? I don't throw balls, I punch with an extension of my fist. Sure, whatever you want to call it. And I cut things with swords. I like swords. Yes, yes you do. And do you find all the chests already? No, still missing one. Yeah, me too. Somebody gave me a hint though. There is one chest that will only appear if you do certain things in that room. What kind of things? Dunno, that's all she told me. She didn't want to spoil the whole secret. Damn it, and there are s more secrets that I missed. Yeah, I don't have. I don't have, you know, I have missed like eight chests. That's horrible. Well, luckily with Fireform, I should be able to make quick work of most enemies. That was rough. Too many chasms, right? The whole dungeon was one large abyss. The last boss was over a cliff for Pete's sake. Yeah, a lot of bosses seem to do that. Still, you made it. I'm pr so proud of you. Gee, thanks. So, let's collect the shade already. We already earned it. We clearly earned it. Are you kidding? They will probably do that floating space thing again. I can't take that stuff right now, please. Oh, come on. Water, frozen water. Solid as rock, smooth as silk. And slippery. Way too slippery. You know there's shoes for that, right? 
So do I get booted out of the dungeon the moment I try to leave those doors? Well, it's not like it matters because there's just a... I can use the elevator whenever I want. Okay, time to go spelunking again. Okay, found it. There. Now I need to worry about the chess. <sighs> well, here's one I missed. Golden Triangle. Found one. Okay, first I need to make the platform go the other way. So I can get that accursed chest. Oh, shoot. Please don't grow. Okay, these do not grow back. Whoa, did this just push me down there again? Dude, not cool. There we go. Oh, yeah. Dropped mic times two. Haha. <laughs> that leaves like how many now? Five more. All right, blue orb times two. Yeah, there's not really enough time to get all these chests the first time around if you're trying to beat Emily. And crystal water. Is that better than normal water? Okay, for the chest in this room, I have to. I think I have to break all these walls, and then fight any enemies that pop out. Hmm. Yeah, that is kind of obscure. Boom. Okay, chest is mine. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme! Give Sweet lemon juice! Yeah, hopefully this will make up for some of the s items I used up just to survive the boss fight. Can't believe I missed this one down here. Furry cat! Oh shit, I should, never should have made one. An extra one, oh well. Probably should equip this during the boss battle. That would have helped, in terms of ice defense. Yeah. And normal defense as well. Yeah, I was stupid and had farming gear on. Okay, there is a rare chest in this room, but I need to get in there from the south side. So, hoppity hop. Huh. Alright, I got all the chests in this bit place. Sweet. I really probably should have gone back here before the boss battle, if only to equip this high level item. Oh well. What's this winter claw? What's so good about it? Brawler. Hmm, very good. Oh, that would have helped so much. Oh, look at that. Seriously. Oh, well, it's mine now. Haha. -ha. Yep, nothing more to do in this place except maybe try to farm these plants. Alright, I completed the botanic section. Oh, finally outside. It's just way too gloomy in those dungeons. Ugh, damn. That was intense. How many more quests do I have? Broken shield is... Yeah, well, I can do that now that I have fire, but... Data probe also requires fire, yeah. Uh... Dry wood, that's gonna require... Where can I get that? Is it... it might be in the next area.
Oh, right, pleasure to see you again, Seeker. I'm not warm. You've conquered the Temple Might and claimed the power of heat, eh? Yes. Well done. That could help us a lot of our current projects underground. Are you up for some mining work? There are explosives. You'll love it. Oh boy. Well, might as well just accept this for now. Okay, time- this time explosives are just a trick. Go for the door at the back and take the elevator down to the first underground floor to reach the mine. Okay. We'll save that for later, maybe. Miner Dora will wait for you on the spot and fill you in on the details. This was a different person, okay. Let's look for some other the other people I owe quests to. Hi. Welcome back, Seeker. I see I've found everything we need. Yes. Truly, this is great news. The entire town of Bergen is in your deck. Lee, here, take these humble rewards. You have earned them ten three times over. Nice. Level up more. What, no new quests? I thought you would after... Okay, I guess not. Let's look for your quest givers, then. And what's your new quest? Er, good day, Seeker. You have chosen a convenient time to pay me a visit. There has been a problem in the Hermit's House, a popular meeting place on Bergen Trail. Supposedly, their power generator has been malfunctioning and needs repairs. For that purpose, they are in need of various materials from different locations. Will your schedule allow for that kind of assistance? Okay. Accept. Very good. You can find the Hermit's House at the Spike Heights on Bergen Trail. Talk to the owner of the house for more details. Okay... Hi! Oh, hi, Leah. You've come at just the right time. You see, I'm pretty new in this guild here. New members are mainly on duty for farming trade items. But we also have to do chores. One of which was just given to me. Oh, it's nothing too hard for the others, I guess. My job is to get a storage unit from the cellar to the right. This, this thing is amazing, I tell you. I couldn't find the thing. Instead, all I found were boxes and more boxes. I already tried to talk to Jock and Jeff, but I can't seem to find them. They're online and they even tried this stupid direct link. No luck. Yeah, I wonder what they're up to. Anyway, I guess what I'm trying to ask is, will you help me find the storage unit? Disciple Gloves? Thanks, Leah. I knew I could count on you. That means I can go into the cellar whenever I need to. Tell the Quadrigar I sent you in the name of our guild. Apparently that's how things work around here. Hopefully you can find this stupid thing. I don't want to make a bad first impression here. What else is there? Hi! Welcome back, Seeker. It is good to see you return to us. And I do feel a strong power within you, as if you have woven the connection to the ancients themselves. Yes, yeah, so with this power of heat, you should probably you should be ready for the next step towards ascension. Will you face your next trial? Hmm. At the temple mine entrance, that person who was meditating. Nods. Yes, I thought as much. The fire inside you is burning to confront the frost that rules these mountains. Go to the entrance of the, to the mine. There you will find Monk Izzy, who will introduce you to the next trial. But know her meditation on the ice tends to be very strong. You'll have to make yourself noticed. That means I'll have to melt her ice. Hi. Hello, Seeker. I have some good news for you, I suppose. We managed to find some hints towards the whereabouts of the imposter guard and his pet goat. So how about it? Are you up to even the score? No, it's very good. You won't even have to walk very far. According to our information, their hideout should be on Rising Path 4 and Bergen Trail. Yes, it's pretty close to your lost encounter, so go get them this time. Bye. Thanks for tuning in to this Let's Play of CrossCode. If you enjoyed, please leave a like, subscribe, and or hit the bell icon.